Tonight, new hope that police will find the person who shot a bar manager in the face on Thanksgiving. And just moments ago, we got an update on Ellie Richardson's recovery. This is from a You Caring page dedicated to her. Quote, Ellie is no longer in the ICU and is progressing very well. She is able to communicate sparingly, drink water, and consume soft foods. Meanwhile, police need help solving this crime. Nine on your side, Jay Warren, talk to police today. Jay. That's right, Cincinnati police are receiving tips and leads. However, they are not able to find as yet the van in question or develop any kind of a suspect in this. That's why they're asking for help from the public. It was in the early morning hours of Thanksgiving here at the intersection of 12th and Walnut that police say a man driving this van shot Richardson, who's an employee at Lachaise. After some words were exchanged, the driver apparently yelled some uh, words towards Miss Richardson. Uh, he s somehow stopped or came to a stop in traffic around 12th and Walnut. It's our understanding that Ellie Richardson approached, started to approach the van, and that's when um, the, the suspect in this case fired one round, striking Ellie in the face. Again, police believe this is the van the man was driving, a maroon Chevy Express conversion van, 1500 series, with running boards on the passenger side. Those who live and work in Over the Rhine have been following the story closely. And while everyone agrees the nature of this neighborhood is vastly different than it was a decade ago, young people I interviewed today say you still want to be careful. It's not like you have to be alert, like very alert at all times, but just, you know, keep an eye out for anything suspicious. I don't really feel unsafe, but then again, I also feel like I have to watch myself because very cautious. you don't know what people will do down here. You can change downtown, but you can't change the people. So we got to watch out for the people. I feel like when I do come down here, I'm more cautious than if I am with someone. But I mean, we're still kind of look behind us every once in a while. Yeah. Cincinnati police says crime can happen anywhere and describes what happened here as a rare occurrence in an area that has seen an incredible turnaround. I want people to know that Over the Rhine is safe. This is a, a rare, not necessarily a random instance, but a rare or unique set of circumstances that occurred here. Now, police also say that crime, violent crime in Over the Rhine is down 26% over last year and saying that really, again, that this is a rare occurrence. One more thing uh, to add, uh, there's a rumor down in that area amongst some of the people who work in the restaurants and bars that uh, perhaps she kicked out this individual out of Lachaise and this was some kind of retribution. Police say there is no evidence to support that at all. And again, they're looking for help to find whoever did this. Call Crime Stoppers if you know anything, 513-352-3040. Jay Warren, 9 on your side, West End.